Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 12th of May 1846, the Donner Party departed Independence, Missouri on their ill fated journey to California. The 1840s had seen a dramatic increase in the number of pioneers undertaking the long and dangerous journey to settle in the western United States. The California Trail shared its initial stages with the 2,170-mile Oregon Trail, but after reading about a shortcut in a new guidebook by Lansford Hastings, a party led by George Donner and James F. Reed decided to take this alternative route. The group of 20 wagons, which carried almost 90 people, found the Hastings cut-off to be considerably rougher terrain than they had been led to believe. Slowed by steep inclines and the need to fell trees and move rocks to provide a path for the wagons, the group struggled to cover more than one and a half miles a day, compared to the 15 that they might have expected to move on the established trail. By the time the party had crossed the Wasatch Mountains and had reached the Great Salt Lake Desert, they were running out of food and water. Families were forced to abandon their animals and, in some cases, even their wagons on the inhospitable plain. By the time they rejoined the main trail route, it's therefore estimated that the Hastings cut-off had cost the group a month's travel time. This was to have catastrophic consequences, since by the time they reached the Sierra Nevada mountains, the group found the trail to be blocked with snow. Forced to spend winter in the mountains, by January some of the families were so short of food that they'd resorted to eating the ox hides that acted as roofs for their cabins. A snowshoe party consequently set out to find help on a 33-day journey that saw them resorting to cannibalism to survive. Although the survivors were rescued, almost half the people who had originally set out from Missouri had died. Thank you.